equally strange parts of this universe. The elusive Chupacabra makes his movie debut. Strange. Strange universe. It's a strange, strange, strange universe. It's a strange universe. It's a strange, 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 strange universe. It's a strange, strange, strange universe. It's a strange universe out there. Out there. Out there. And we've got it covered. We've got it covered. And 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 we've got it covered. We've got it covered. What's happening? We first met up with the Chupacabra as it rampaged through Puerto Rico. The strange creature whose name means goat sucker. We tracked him through Texas, Mexico, California. Now, Frank Grimes finds him in Hollywood? This is the beast. And this is the beauty. Okay, here we go. An action. Uh, and both are starring in a new movie inspired by the stories that Strange Universe has been covering for months now. It's a real thing. Be careful of the chupacabra. Okay, Chup, take some swings. Ripped from the headlines, Guns of El Chupacabra, the first in a trilogy of chupacabra flicks starring the sci-fi B-movie pinup, comic book queen, and author, Julie Strange. In the movie, Julie goes head to head with the legendary beast. Okay, taunting the chew. And as far fetched as it sounds, the producer of the movie, Scott Shaw, swears he's had a first hand run in with the chupacabra itself. You know, there was all these, these dead animals that we kept seeing along the road, and as the, as, the, as the night came on, we saw this creature like dart across the road. The car that was in front of us flipped over. Scott Shaw says it happened when he was in Mexico scouting locations for another movie. Director Don Jackson was there and says he saw it too. He's even cooked up a conspiracy theory about the chupacabra. Some people actually think it's a, uh, it's a government genetic experiment gone bad and um, government agencies are trying to hush things up. Still, there's other groups that say it's like an alien or it's the pets of the aliens and they, these things have invaded Earth and they've been here for centuries. Take a swing at it with your claw. Take a swing at it. Good. Great. As for Julie Strain, she's only fighting a creature on screen, but she doesn't doubt that the real thing is out there somewhere. I thought it was a mythological creature until someone read that in a marine handbook that they had a warning to beware of a blood-eating animal at night. And there was one more surprise to be found on the set. Okay, that's a cut. Out of costume, the beast actually turns out to be a beauty herself. Oh, it's warm in here. <sighs> it's not easy being a chupa. The chupacabra was reportedly last seen in San Antonio, Texas.